Hello everyone, Matthew Taylor here, aka Zombies and Free Five, and today I am bringing you five horror game facts that you might not have known, and the six of the coolest games from E3 coming to next gen in this year and the, in the upcoming year. Years. Right. Horror game facts you might not have known. Number 5. Extermination, the game, was intended to rival the Resident Evil franchise. Number 4. The Devil May, Devil May Cry was intended to be the original Resident Evil 4. Silent Hill was developed by Paroled Konomi staff. Number 2. Resident Evil 2 was developed twice. And the Resident Evil that you play is not what the first original one was intended to be. Number 1. Resident Evil Code Veronica was originally called Resident Evil 3 and Nemesis was different. There were these were the five horror game facts that you might have not have known. Right now we have the six coolest games from E3 2015. Right, number one, The Last Guardian. Number two, Final Fantasy. Seven. Number three, Uncharted 4, A Thief's End. Number five, Fallout 4. Number six, Horizon Zero Dawn. And number seven, Hitman. Now these are only a few of the games highlighted, but that are sure to get you wondering what is going to be, what else is going to be released, and what you hope to see in the future. Now keep tuned, because I will do more updates and I will be bringing you more gameplay such as this amazing Black Flag gameplay It is beautiful, is it not? It is beautiful, beautiful gameplay Here is a just a random and a little fact that you you probably know this is about five nights at Freddy's even though there is no specified year in which the game takes place many have assumed that it takes place around 1993 as it as the paycheck matches the minimum wage of that time now that was a little random fact about Five Nights at Freddy's and um, I'll be bringing you more soon um, keeping you updated and bringing you information that you might not have known here's a little um, GTA 5 fact there is a ben park bench in Pacific Bluffs paying respect to Chris Edwards, a Rockstar employee who was credited for working on Max Payne. Mr. Edwards unfortunately passed away in 2014, and the bench is his tribute. What lovely little thing they've done for him. And on that note, all well, that is all the lovely time we have got for today. Please subscribe, leave a like button below, check out the previous videos, 
And I'll see you a lot later.